Hello, we're going to talk about how to switch your test complete instance from pointing to the old license manager to the new license manager, Smart Bear License Management, or SLM for short. <clears throat> All right, so I have my test complete instance here. It is currently pointing to the old license manager that is hosted on this machine. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to help drop down and we're going to select this option here, switch to smart bear ID based licensing. Uh, once we select that test complete will close and then it's going to reopen and then prompt you to log in with your SLM account. Uh, if you don't have an SLM account, you can go to manage.smartbear.com to create one. All right. <clears throat> so when test complete reopens, it will prompt you to uh, log in with your, your, SLM account. We're going to log in with my account here. All right, so I'm using a single sign-on. So I'm going to have to now log into that single sign-on account. And <clears throat> And as long as you're assigned to a license, a test complete license in Smart Bear License Management, the SLM portal, um, once you log in, it will pull that license in. So that way you can then start using that test complete license with this instance of test complete. Uh, this is a VM that I'm using. So I'm gonna be pulling a floating license. <clears throat> Also, the uh, SLM account I'm using, it's not the same as the Windows account. It's a shared VM. All right, so now we have test complete, and now we are now logged in, and it's pointing to the new Smart Bear License Manager. Uh, and you can tell that we have this up here. Now where we didn't have that before when it was pointing to the old License Manager. And this will give you the user information of the SLM account that is now logged in. It shows you the user's name, the email address, and which licenses that they are able to, uh, which licenses they're able to use, uh, the different modules of, of, of task complete. All right. And if you want to switch users, you can just come here, log out, and then log in with the different SLM account.